Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie, and today we are watching Parasite. And that's Coda in the background. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel, everyone. Thank you so much for being here and welcome if you're new. Today we are diving on into a movie that I have wanted to watch for so long, literally since it was nominated for an Oscar, and that is Parasite. And I think around that time, I just was really busy and I didn't get around to seeing it when it was up for an Oscar and eventually won Best Picture. And then shortly after the pandemic hit and I started watching movies here on my channel and I realized that oh I should watch this as a part of my channel and I was just having a hard time getting it to win in some polls over on Patreon it took a little while I would slip it into a poll here or there and it wouldn't win and finally it has won a poll over on my Patreon page and I'm really excited to be watching this movie finally I believe that this movie is the first South Korean film to ever be nominated and the first foreign language film to win Best Picture, which is crazy that it's taken so long for a foreign language film to win. I'm really excited to check it out. And it's interesting because the cover looks kind of intense and the name Parasite, like I thought it was going to be more of a thriller, but then looking at the description of the movie, I didn't read the logline or anything, but just the description says it's a comedy slash drama. Um, I love a good dramedy, so I'm really interested to see what this movie is about and what the writing style is like. Hopefully me talking over part of this movie won't be too challenging because I will admit that, you know, I know I do talk a lot over the movies, but I don't apologize for that because that's kind of my reaction style. I like to talk a lot and uh, usually it works out for me fine because I'll put on closed captions and then I also hear what's going on. But for a movie like this, I'm going to be relying solely on closed captions. So if I don't read everything, or if I'm talking and somebody says something and I miss it, that might be a little challenging, but I'll do my best to try to catch every moment. I usually um, have a hard time catching every moment when I'm watching a movie for the first time anyway, even if I'm not reacting to it here on YouTube. It usually takes a couple watches for everything to kind of sink in, but I'm excited to be diving into something new and different with you guys here today. And with all that being said, I don't want to talk much longer. I just kind of want to sit and watch this movie with y'all. I'm really excited and eager to see what it has in store. I always get really excited when I got to watch Oscar nominated and um, Oscar winners with you guys because it's just a different kind of experience and it's always dependent on the movie as well. Like we just did Rocky recently, which won Best Picture and I would imagine that this is going to be very different <laughs> from Rocky. But it's always a fun experience. It's always informative and I always think it's uh, just a really fulfilling experience to watch movies that are just crafted so well, so I'm really excited. And with all that being said, I think we should just grab a drink, grab a snack, and let's get into the movie. 야, 위집 아줌마랑 IP 타임. Oh no, they were <laughs> bogarting the Wi-Fi from upstairs. Oh, you gotta be up by the toilet. Oh, that's so sad. 뭐야? 소독해? 손은 닫어. 나도 봐. Freaks. Oh, God. Yeah, that's not that's not good for you, though. Oh, Jesus. Guys, oh, God, get out of there. It's going to be so bad for you. Oh, we could have met outside. Is he ashamed of his house? What is that? A rock? Scholars rocks. Oh, it's said to bring material wealth to families. Oh. She's so sassy! <laughs> She's so sassy! At first I was like, he brought them a rock, but it's a sweet gesture. Oh, you're not a loser, you're very charismatic. It's kind of creepy. <laughs> Just waiting for her to be old enough. I thought he was asking to help his friend out, but it's more about he doesn't trust his frat bros. Oh, I'm going to Photoshop a college degree. <laughs> Oxford have a major in document poetry. 
she should be able to get a great job <laughs> with her skills. Although you can't really put document forgery on a resume. Now we're going to see the wealthier side of town, huh? Streets are so much wider. Walls are so much higher. Fancy doorbell. This looks like a mansion in the Hollywood Hills. I feel like I've seen these on like those luxury real estate mansion tours on YouTube. And they the tour out. The inside's nice too. <laughs> oh, house slippers, yeah. That's one thing I really do like about a lot of Asian households. It's uh, it's like impolite to not take your shoes off. And in America, people look at you weird when you ask them to do that. But I like I like that tradition a lot. It keeps the house cleaner. 제 입장에서는 그쪽이 민영 쌤 같은 어떤 레벨이 아니라면 뭐 그게 무슨 의미가 있나 뭐 이런. Jeez, that's so messed up to say with a smile. Oh, she wants to sit in. Ooh, that's terrifying. The way she's carrying that Pomeranian! That dog did not look very comfortable. Just got one arm around it. Yubo. Oh, he was measuring her pulse, so. Oh. oh, this is the tactic he's taking. Interesting. Oh, she added a bit for inflation. How thoughtful. Oh, is that their little boy? That's so cute. That's where all the arrows come from. A self-portrait! Mmm, <laughs> yes, very good. <laughs> oh, he's gonna suck his, suck his sister. Yes, give it to your sister. The job, yes. Jessica. Ah, oh, right. Jessica, Jessica. I mean, my sister's wife. They're gonna have to pretend that they're not related. <laughs> he's gonna get his whole family jobs. She's really good at forgery. This is hilarious, man. Jessica, Illinois, Chicago. She's practicing before they go in. Smart. Oh no, is this girl gonna have a crush on her new tutor, Kevin? Or is she suspicious? She's either suspicious or she has a crush on Kevin. I can't tell which it is. Oh, I love the way that was filmed, seeing her creeping up the stairs just at that time. And that was a cool shot. I liked that. I love a good wide. Oh. She's smarter than her mother. Oh, ew. She does have a crush on Kevin. She does have a crush on Kevin. She does. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ew. You should you should lie and say that you that you're dating your sister. I mean, not really. That would be gross. But uh oh, uh oh, oh no, oh no, no 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 no. Dude, you've only had this job one day. What is wrong with you? <gasps> She's a child. Oh my god, this is horrible. This is so this is so bad. This is like so bad. He screwed this whole thing up in one day. In one day, he screwed it all up. Maybe his sister his sister maybe will do better than than he is doing because this kid is really little. Oh, she's so confident. I love it. She's nervous because she's not allowed to be in the room. I like I like Jessica's tactic. I think it's great. Ah! Oh my god, the way this is filmed is just great. I love it. The variation in shots. I love the cinematography. It's like just the right balance. It's not too jarring. <gasps> She's just making shit up right now and worrying this mother. Oh my god. This mother is so gullible. Four two-hour sessions per week. That's a lot. Oh, she probably doesn't want to get dropped off at her home. Yeah, she can't let him see where she lives. What is she doing right now? What? I wonder what her plan was there with the underwear. He set a trap. She set a trap. So she left her underwear there. Are they going to try to tear apart this family? <laughs> what is her goal with it? Oh, God. Oh, he's going to see the underwear. Is he going to think his driver is screwing Jessica? Does that mean he's going to fire his driver? Ooh, I like that subtle, like just the light bulbs turning on one by one as he climbed the steps. That was cool. Isn't he just going to think that it was Je is that it was the art teacher, though? Oh, dude. Oh, poor driver. He's gonna lose his job. Oh my pillow from cocaine, you don't I like how he whispered that, even though the house is huge. I don't think your kids are gonna hear you. Oh, she is listening. <laughs> She's gonna recommend her dad. Are you kidding me? Though I, 
I they really shouldn't give their mother a job though because she's not good at faking it. You know, she's kind of sassy. 믿는 사람 소개로 연결 연결 이게 베스트인 것 같아요. 일종의 뭐랄까 믿음의 벨트. A belt of trust. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah. What happens when uh, when Min comes back and realizes that the girl he liked now likes his friend and that his friend is given job like work to all of his family members? Like I feel like Min may be a little upset. She may look like a sheep and inside she's a fox. Ooh. Oh, the housekeeper. No. Are they gonna get make her lose her job? Don't do that. That's so mean. Don't 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 do. Oh, this is so mean. No. The nice woman who's always cutting up fruit. That's sad. Why are peaches a forbidden fruit? Oh, that's how they're gonna do it. They're gonna bring in peaches. Oh! This is so, this is so mean. Oh. Oh my god, this woman really is so unbelievably gullible. He's acting! He's superb! He's practicing! They're coaching him! This is so f***ed up! Wow, this is so f***ed up. You would fire somebody who'd been a part of your house for years. They knew what she was gonna say! I just feel so bad for this like sweet little housekeeper who's about to lose her job. I don't feel as bad for the driver, I feel bad for her. To make her start coughing. Oh my god. She's just so easily manipulated, it's like... Is she gonna faint? <laughs> Oh my god, the drama. It's great. Oh. Oh, this is horrible. This is so sad. He loves her too. Like this is going to make the little kid depressed. That's so sad. 그분. 예. 왜 갑자기 관동 건지 집사람은 설명도 안해 주고 참. Oh boy. 하긴 뭐. 아줌마의 세. Easy enough to hire new one. Oh, here we go. Cue the last family member. Although, like, I don't think anyone can live up to the previous one, especially this mother. She's just kind of sassy. Don't care. What's it again? Ha ha ha! They even forged little business cards. I guess it's not forgery. It's just a lie that the business. Ah, 병원만 봐도 고급스럽네 진짜. You can thank Jessica for that. Ah, 뭐어몇 가지 서류들을 좀 준비해 주시면 되는데. To prove your income level so that you can hire a housekeeper. The title to your property! Oh my god, this woman is so... Sweet. <laughs> this mother. Like, you don't need to give your property title to hire a maid. Aww. That kid really is so cute. <laughs> this is just so funny. Don't do that! <gasps> oh no! Oh, when are they gonna all get caught? Is it? Is it it's got to be because of Min when he comes back from studying abroad, huh? <laughs> huh? Is he smelling them? <laughs> that kid is so perceptive. It's funny. Their kids are a lot smarter than the parents. <laughs> I have a feeling you guys won't keep the job when Min returns. It's all because of that rock that Min brought over. Are they going on vacation? Oh, they're going camping. I'd be worried that there would be cameras in this house. That was the funniest reveal ever. Oh, they're chilling in the house. Can't say I blame them, but I'd just be worried that there'd be cameras. Do not hit the house. She threw a shot put into another person's car. Oh boy. Isn't that what Min said? Yeah, he doesn't like- Oh no, oh. Do you think he's gonna marry into it? You guys are getting a little delusional here. I feel like it's about to hit the fan. Like, they're living the high life right now, but I feel like it's gonna all come crashing down here real quick. We can bring in actors to be my mom and dad. <laughs> oh, that's- I don't like that. That's mean. You don't need to be mean to the dog, okay? What the hell, guys? 
Guys, don't do what the f Guys, you just destroyed some of their items. <laughs> It's funny because I gasped because she was eating dog treats, but then the doorbell rang at the same time. It's the old housekeeper? What is she doing? You shouldn't let her in, but they're probably going to. They just turned the lights off in the living room. What did she forget in the basement? Oh. Why am I scared she's about to like kill herself? I'm like terrified right now. That was really scary. Is there like a gun in the basement and she's gonna use it? I don't know why I'm thinking the worst right now. She just looks a little unhinged and I worry that like they ruined her life by losing her job. You shouldn't have let her in. This is where everything's gonna start to unravel. <laughs> she trying to move that? What is that? What is she doing? Is there a safe behind there? What is she trying to do? <laughs> this woman. Yama! Honey, honey, who is, who's down here? Yama, honey, I'm here. This is turning into a horror movie. I am so scared right now. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God, she was taking care of her partner down here. Oh my god, just like they're mooching off of the family, she was too! She was living here! Oh, secret bunkers. <laughs> if the creditors break it. Oh, so the new owners, Mr. Park, didn't know about it. It was just the original architect. So she had a free place for her husband to live. <laughs> you are needy! You are absolutely needy. How can you judge her for what she's doing after what you guys did? Oh, they're searching for him. Oh, watching him eat that banana was creepy. Oh my God, this is so crazy. That's karma for you. That's karma for you. You're mooching too. You are no better than them. Oh, and they're saying, they're saying dad, too. <laughs> Did she lock them down there? Oh, no, they just got to sit there and watch. Wait, why are they in that weird position? Why do they have to sit there holding their hands up like that? Oh, they're reminiscing about when they used to be in this house alone together. Listen, at least the house is getting some love, you know? A lot of people are, can reap the benefits of a house like this. Doesn't need to be just one family. Oh my god. I would love it if the Park family just kind of came in at this moment. And the thunderstorm just gets crazier. The dogs are out! The poor dogs probably really need to be let out. Oh, Jesus. I feel like somebody's about to die. I'm really concerned. Just don't hurt one of the dogs. What is this? She gonna suffocate her? Oh, she's rubbing peaches on her. Oh, you're gonna kill her. <laughs> Who is it now? This is crazy. This is so crazy. <laughs> They're coming home early because of the thunderstorm. Camping was a failure, huh? Because it's raining. Eight minutes? You guys are fucked. Y'all are fucked. There is no way that you can clean. Oh, this is the tactic she's taking. She's gonna try to, he's trying to force him back down into the cellar. That's kind of f***ed up. <laughs> I guess he doesn't have anywhere else to go though. They're gonna scream down here though. Oh, this, oh Jesus. She's cutting herself. Oh my God, this is so chaotic. Oh my God, you're hog tying him? That's f***ed up. Oh, she's like probably dying because she's going into anaphylactic shock. Jesus, this poor housekeeper. I feel really bad for her. All because of money. She's dead. This is getting so creepy, y'all. What is he doing? He's controlling the lights? He's the one that does the lights. He controls those lights and no one's ever figured it out? Respect! Oh, he, he praises him. Oh, he's sending Morse code. 
다송이는 이런 거알 텐데 스카우트니까. The song really is like the smartest person in this family. 다송이가 좀 No, he's not. He's the only one that's got with the program in your family. He's the smartest one. 무슨 언니도 귀신 믿죠. Ghosts? How did Jessica guess that right? Oh, he didn't see a ghost. He saw this mother. He saw this guy and they thought he'd seen a ghost. 기가 막혔거든. 애가 침대 누워서도 자꾸 생각이 나. <gasps> wow, that transition was so cool. I loved that editing was just showing the fridge opening and the cake on the floor. There he is. Oh, that's really scary. That's really scary. That is really scary to experience as a child. This girl's gonna have to spend the entire night under this table in the di living room. They say a ghost in the house brings wealth? Oh, well, that's good, because you have two now. Is she, is she breathing? What's thank God for? He broke the crank. That's so f***ed up. Guys, get the f*** out of there. Oh, they don't even have shoes. Where are their stuff? Didn't they show up here with stuff? Oh no. He's putting a teepee up in the backyard. She's sitting on the table. Ah! I, this family, I feel like they're gonna get caught. Oh, she's texting Kevin. Oh my God, Kevin. Oh my God, Kevin. Oh my God. Yeah, this family's screwed. Especially since he started an immoral relationship with the daughter he's tutoring, like. Oh no. <laughs> oh, they're so screwed. They're so getting caught. Oh, they smell, they smell, oh no. Kim Oh, he's smelling himself now. Oh, this is hurting his feelings. They're passed out cold, sneak out now. You never know. I don't know, I'd be terrified. I guess you do have to sneak out at some point though. If you stay here until the daylight and then they catch you then, it's, it's so much worse than if you'd maybe su successfully snuck out. Although I feel like the kid is, isn't this gonna be heard? Isn't this gonna be heard? Go, 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 oh my God. Holy Whoa, this is so intense. They have to run home barefoot in the rain, in pajamas. This is like so metaphorical. It's like they're getting washed down the street back to like, and we saw that clip holding on the sewer. It's like how they feel like right now, like leaving that like beautiful mansion and this luxurious life that they can't afford and then getting pushed back into their old neighborhood. This is so sad. Oh, it's sewage water. Oh, their window, is it open? Their whole place is gonna be flooded with sewage water. Oh my God. Oh my God, there's electricity. Oh my God, that's so disgusting. Oh God. I mean, oh, talk about karma, Jesus. But also that's horrible. What is that? Oh, a cigarette. Girl, get the f out of there, man. Oh my God, the set design is insane. Oh, the rock. The rock for prosperity is floating in sewage water. That is so intense. Oh, he's studying the Morse code. Oh, he got himself off of the pole. Help. Oh, help me. Oh, God. And it's so like, it parallels the lights flickering in their house too, and their whole house is being flooded with sewage water. Oh my God. Oh, 제시카쌤, 일요일 아침에 죄송해요. 혹시 오늘 점심에 시간 되시나? 아니, 오늘 집에서 다송이 생일 번개 하려고요. 아, 생일 번개. 케빈스만테도 연락해 볼까 보시. Are they going to invite the entire family and then they're going to find out what they've been doing while they're all at this party? Because Kevin is a little genius. This party is probably going to be a bummer of a party. <laughs> is she dead down there? The woman, the former housekeeper? I'm worried she's dead. <laughs> Why do that sort of mess with you? Oh my God, it's so jarring with uh, her just laughing on the phone, giggling joyfully, singing in the background, and he's having a panic attack, like the family is spiraling out of control and you just hear the little intense music overlapped with the playful music. It's just so suspenseful. <laughs> she is so relaxed. Oh, oh, he's really tired. Don't fall asleep at the wheel, dude. Oh, she can smell him now. It's the, is she smelling the sewer? <gasps> the rain was such a blessing. Oh, so ironic. The rain was such a blessing. God. <gasps> 
Kevin, this is, I'm sorry. This whole job was from the start when Kevin let this happen. Oh, he's got to go down lower. Is he bringing the rock to them that are trapped in the in the basement? Oh, yo, yo, you guys really shouldn't be wearing this. <laughs> oh, God, they're doing a reenactment. That's great. Wow, that's all that matters to him. I thought for a second he was maybe going to say, are you okay? And no, he doesn't give a about this poor man. <laughs> His trauma recovery cake. Something tells me that DeSong is about to be more traumatized after that Morse code message that he saw. This guy is going down with a rock and no water and food. I think they need more than a rock, bro. Was he going down there to... When he said, I'll take care of it, what did he mean by take care of it? Is his plan to like maybe not give them a rock? Maybe he, maybe he, his plan was to finish the job and kill them so that, that it's not an issue for his family because he feels responsible. How f***ing crazy would it be if his whole plan was to kill her, them with a rock? Like the rock of prosperity that was a gift from men. That's insane. <gasps> you're screwed, dude. Oh, you're screwed, bro. <laughs> I knew he was gonna get yanked back like that. I knew it. Did Kevin just die? This family's about to be traumatized, y'all. They're about to be traumatized. Oh God, he smashed his own nose in doing the Morse code. Oh, he's about to scare the out of everyone. Oh, Kevin's dead. You know, if that was his intent. <gasps> oh my God, I couldn't even watch that. Jesus. Who's he gonna kill? Is he gonna try to kill the rest of the family? Maybe he's gonna go after Mr. Kim. Uh, no, girl, go back upstairs, girl. Go back upstairs. Oh no, she's gonna see Kevin. She's gonna see Kevin and that's gonna traumatize her, this whole family. Oh no. <laughs> the fact that she threw this surprise. Oh my God, he's killing everyone. He wants to attack everybody. Oh, she found Kevin. Their kids are both dying. She's dead. That was like straight to the heart. Oh my God, his whole family is gonna die. Oh my God. Even now, he's just concerned about the smell? Even now, he's just concerned about the smell? Oh, you're dead, son. Oh my God, we, okay, but like, did we really have to take those children's father away? Even if he disgusts you. Oh my God, he couldn't hold in his rage for him any longer. He survived, he survived the, the shish kebab? Oh no, was it Kevin? Kevin survived? They were lucky, they got away with probation. Oh my God, wait, no, his, his sister did die because she's not here, she's dead. Oh, he kept laughing because of his brain injury. Oh, it's so sad that she's the one that died. She had the most promise, you know? It's like kind of fitting because she like started it with the forgery. <laughs> oh, right, because Kim is on the run, wow. Yeah, where did his dad go? <laughs> is he down in the basement? How crazy would it be if his dad went down into the basement and that's why you couldn't see him on CCTVs? Oh. <laughs> He's spying on them, that's so creepy. Are there new people living in that house now? I would assume. <gasps> Morse code, his dad is down there. His dad is down there. He's totally in there. Oh my God, his dad is in there. That's crazy. Oh, right, because he was a Cub Scout. I didn't realize he learned Morse code in the Scouts. I want Tyler's an Eagle Scout. I should ask if he learned Morse code. <gasps> oh, that's of the dog eating the shish Oh, but that CCTV camera was cut. Right, that's how he wasn't caught. It's like he knew that was the only place he could really hide. Wow, that's so crazy. Oh, why, what did he do? Did he bury her in the backyard? All right, I mean, at least the bar they buried her. It's the least you could do, I suppose. 
How poetic is it? Like they all, they, he got his whole family working for this house and bad karma came their way. And now like he committed this crime and he's trapped. He's trapped in this house that they used to pretend like they played house in it and like loved it and wanted to stay working for this family. And now he's like trapped there. It's a prison. That's so crazy. He's putting the rock in the water. <gasps> he's letting go of it. Oh. Is this plan to buy the house? Is this plan to buy the house? Seriously? And hope that he's still alive? Are you serious? He bought the house? So that... Oh my god. How did he earn money? That was his plan. His plan was to... He, he was motivated and was able to do it in order to save his dad. Holy <laughs> This is crazy. This story has taken such a wild turn. Oh my goodness, man. Oh, that was a dream. That was a dream. Oh my god. Wow. Holy It's <laughs> so good! Oh my god. I'm so impressed and like shook. I honestly just like, don't have the words. <laughs> I'm like speechless right now. I'm really excited to um, hear your guys' thoughts on this one in the comments down below because I think this is definitely a movie that is going to be really interesting to talk about with people. I'm really excited to chat with people in my life who've seen this because... There's so many interesting things going on in this movie and so many really interesting metaphors, like showing what greed can do to a person, but also like seeing how judgmental um, Mr. Park was. And then the shift between the original guy who was stuck in the basement and blessed Mr. Park every day for being able to live there. And then when Mr. Kim killed Mr. Park and then he had to take the place of the guy who used to be there in the house and it, it had become a prison to him. That's just so crazy. <laughs> you know, this house and this family were a blessing to them in the beginning, but in the end it was their downfall. And, you know, it's also because of the way they handled the whole situation. I mean, there was a lot of, there were a lot of crimes committed and horrible things that they did to get where they were. But I mean, it's still very empathetic. It, it, you know, you feel for for people in situations like that. So it, it was just so intense. The cinematography was so incredible. I know that the cinematography is good <laughs> in a movie when I don't notice how often the shots are shifting and I only notice shots that, like, move me in a, in a great way. Um, like... There are times when I notice that people will go from wide to close to medium, wide to medium to close, and it's too much sometimes. Like, certain shots will shift too much. But with a movie like this, you know, they really were not afraid to utilize good wide shots and um, change the perspective in really interesting ways or even just following people around corners in interesting ways. But it wasn't so noticeable that it was off-putting. It really just accentuated the storytelling and elevated it, and I really liked it especially because some of the shots kind of induced suspense in the beginning of the movie um like just showing the daughter listening to them in the stairwell and you could see them in the kitchen and then she'd be running upstairs as kevin was going to go upstairs and little things like that are just so playful but then in the end when you're seeing them sneak around the house and trying not to get caught and it's really like a life or death situation that became, it's like they had laid little breadcrumbs for that. And so then when the shots became suspenseful and long and winding later in the movie, it it still worked with the way the piece had been earlier in the film. So I really liked that score was great. I think it was like classical music the entire time, which is also really interesting because I feel like classical music is something that's kind of associated with the wealthy and associated with people who are more well off because it's just it's something like opera right where you don't associate people who are less fortunate as being able to afford to go to an opera or to a classical musical concert it's more like something that someone who has money would do so i think it was just interesting that the entire piece was classical music it also i just love classical music in general because you can do really interesting things with it and there were I mean, I really liked what they did score wise when everybody was setting up for the party and it was like two different songs overlapped with one another. It was like this really suspenseful, intense, dark pulsing 
with this playful music over top of it because it's like, oh, we're setting up for a birthday party, but it's really actually ominous and horrifying what's going on. So yeah, it was just really well done. Really liked this movie. I can see why it won Best Picture, which isn't something I always say. Sometimes you see a movie that wins Best Picture and um, and, and you see it, what other movies it was stacked up against and you go, hmm, I don't know if I would have done that. But this movie was brilliant. I really liked it. It was so funny for the first half of it. And then the second half was just like so intense and uh, got much, much darker. I'm sure that as I spend more time thinking about this piece, I'll have more and more things to say. Right now, I'm still kind of processing a lot of it, but I really enjoyed it. I'll definitely be interested to check out more from this director, too, because I, I think this piece was executed really well. Ugh, just the whole time when they're leaving the house, too, and we just see them going down, further and further down stairs, you know? Even the street that the people live on, it's on the top of this huge hill. And when they're coming down like the street, that's even a downgrade. And then they're coming down stairs and more stairs and it's just downpouring on them. And and then their whole street is just flooded with sewer water. It's like, and then we're, you know, Mr. Park is judging the way that they smell. And it's like, oh God, it's just like heartbreaking. Um, you can just really get a sense for how that family must feel. It's just such a juxtaposition, really interesting. I'm really glad that I finally got to watch this one with you guys, and I'm definitely curious to see what your thoughts are in the comments down below. But for now, that is all I have for y'all in this video. So if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up because it really helps me out and it lets me know that you guys want to see more stuff like this. Of course, let me know your thoughts in the comments down below and anything else you might like me to watch next, and subscribe if you want to. Till the next one, stay golden. Bye.